guys i don't know how i feel about doing this journal series but i've decided that i'm gonna do like a self-love um journal topic type of video i've made a decision that i want to start applying the bible to my life so i've started off with genesis right and as you know that's when the most high creates the world right so he starts creating the world the animals the humans right and i've come to this conclusion that if i'm a creation of god right if he created me why i'm not showing myself that love and respect that i deserve right so i've realized that self-love in my opinion is taking care of yourself your body your health making healthy decisions for yourself making the best decisions for your future you know the people around you that is self-care that's self-love right so i've decided that i'm really sorry for any background noise um so i've decided that i'm going to start prioritizing myself even though it sounds selfish i'm going to start doing that. i've come to the conclusion that for the longest time ever i've been neglecting myself so i've been putting like work first other things first um people's needs first um rushing for other people like i haven't prioritized me i haven't done things that make me feel good or healthy things like i've been um, neglecting my sleep patterns i haven't been eating the best um i haven't been taking care of my skin um i rarely like doing the beauty treatments to my face um as you guys already know i did that glow up series and that was like the first time in ever that i actually pampered myself looked after myself tried to make myself look my best so that was very alien to me so with this journal i'm going to try and prioritize self-care right because i deserve it right if god created me i deserve to pour the best into me as well and that when you're around toxic people or toxic environments it's very hard to love yourself because you tend to neglect yourself and you're going to survival mode, right? And then their feelings of you is projected onto you to make you feel like you're unworthy. You don't deserve good things, you know. You deserve to be miserable. And this is something that I'm going to be navigating through. I'm going to try and journal my feelings with you guys. I'm going to try and be raw and real with you. And so you guys can see where I am on this journey. But to be honest, like, I do struggle with taking care of me. I mean um the internet is tough as well like um there's a lot of judgment women judging each other it's just so hard it's like a battle you know it's being a man is hard as well but being a woman is also hard it's just so much expectations of us if you've read genesis you will know that he created man in his own image right so if we're creating in his created in his own image we need to be perfect we need to be perfect like god and we can't be perfect if we're not taking care of ourselves, if we are abusing our bodies, if we're drinking, we're smoking, we're eating unhealthy, we're not working out, we're not getting enough sleep, we're not showing love to the people around us, we're miserable, we're grouchy, you know, we're snapping at everybody, we we just want everything to happen for us, it's all me, 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 when am I going to meet my future partner, when am I going to get this, when am I going to get everything delivered to me, no, snap out of it, right? We've got to go back to the basics, the basic needs of a human, right? We need shelter, we need food, we need sleep. We need to take care of ourselves. It's so important. So guys, to kickstart this self-love journey, my hair is looking crazy, but I don't care, right? <laughs> I have decided to take care of my natural hair, right? So I'm not very good at, like, looking after my hair and stuff. I've been neglecting it for the longest time ever. I will put a hat on to record my videos. I won't even comb my hair. My hair is usually all knotted and matted. And today I decided, it's Monday. I actually took two days off yesterday. I was like, right, forget this. I'm not doing any work. I'm going to take the weekend off. And it was good to just shut off, to shut off from work. This is a reminder for anyone watching this to book some time off from work and shut off. Just get a break. You deserve it, right? So what I did was I had Saturday and Sunday off and then Monday, which is Monday, Monday is today, right? So I was like, today's the day I'm going to tackle my hair, right? So I couldn't find my shampoo because I have so much clutter, right? But I managed to borrow somebody else's and when I tell you the results was better, like my hair was easier to detangle 
I feel like I need to invest in a better shampoo and stop buying cheap ones. I also detangled my hair with Aunt Jackie's curls and coils, not on my watch. So this makes it a little bit easier to get through the knots in my hair. So that's kind of where I'm at at this journey. I want to try more of her products as well. Her, whoever created it, I don't know. <laughs> but um, guys, start taking care of yourself. Um, if you are spiritual and you you want to get closer to God, like love him first as well. And we've got to start taking care of God's creations. Everything around us, we've got to start loving what he's given us as well. So I hope you enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more series. Bye.